with this one, I always ask permission to cup the hip. So the reason why we wanted to cup the hip, the opposite side, is so we don't put any pressure right on the ASIS, anterior superior iliac spine region. So you're going to cup it, then you're actually going to pull the quadriceps transverse the abdominals, and eventually you're going to bring it around like this more. But again, it's a great massage technique like this, but just make sure they're aware um, that you're actually putting your hands in this region, that they're okay with it then. And some people are really ticklish in this area, so you can actually get a towel and actually put it over here too, so they're a little, it's a little bit more comfortable for them. Or I've actually had a few students that were just totally ticklish, so you just actually place their hand right there and perform the technique too, so it's a little bit more comfortable for them. Okay, next one, you can actually kind of just lean your own body, just lean your own body weight back and actually just kind of pull up. So eventually it's going to go around like this. And then for the diaphragm region, you want to make sure you find out where the xiphoid process is. Make sure you don't put a lot of pressure there. And just underneath that, so the thumbs will eventually come around like this then for the techniques. So again, you're going to kind of hook and go around. So especially if they have any kind of breathing problems, that's where you're going to concentrate on them. And then also, let's say um, you did posture evaluation, this side was a little bit more contracted. So what we're going to do is actually kind of hook the iliac crest region. You can actually cross hand it, go up. So again, this hand's doing the movement, this one's just hooking. So this one isn't moving at all, so it's planted firmly then. Okay, next one, you can kind of separate. So both hands can eventually go around like this this technique. Okay, next one, you're just going to actually put their hand right here, and you can go underneath and kind of just lift up, go right around the quadriceps region, or again you can actually go to the opposite side, but again, you might want to put your knee on the table a little bit just to feel a little bit more comfortable. So if you're going to go work opposite sides, so you're not going to be bending so much with your back then in those areas. Okay, let's go to the hand region. 